This podcast is produced by the Harwood Productions Podcast Network. To learn more about the network and to find more of our shows, visit us online at www.harwoodpodcast.com. Shortbread is a classic butter cookie, and so what I've done is taken that and then added some dried apricots, some lemon zest, and some chopped almonds. So you heard me say it, butter cookie. So to start, we have to put in two sticks of softened butter into our mixer and get that nice and creamy. Then take three quarters of a cup of white sugar and kind of gradually pour that into the mixer while, and let it blend with the butter. And then we're gonna let that go for about two minutes till it gets really fluffy and light. Then we're gonna put in two tablespoons of milk and a teaspoon of vanilla and let that mix together. Then take the zest of one lemon, it ends up being about a teaspoon full of lemon zest and pop that in and then just a half a teaspoon of salt. Then go ahead and stop the mixer and put in about two and a half cups of flour and get that nice and mixed in with your other ingredients. Then we're gonna take some chopped apricots, the dried kind, and add about three quarters of a cup and you want those apricots to be pretty finely chopped. And then we're gonna go ahead and add a half a cup of chopped slivered almonds, again, finely chopped. Now, once the ingredients are all mixed up, we're gonna stop the mixer and take our spatula and just do a quick mix down, make sure all the flour is mixed in. And then you're gonna to wanna to get two pieces of plastic wrap and uh, you're gonna divide the dough in half. So on this piece, I'm gonna take just half of the dough and then I'm gonna shape it into a log. Now, when you're shaping the log, the idea is for um, it to be the same diameter pretty much all the way through the log. So you have to kind of work with it just a little bit. It's a, it's a nice sturdy dough, so you don't have to worry about that. The reason I'm not using my hands a ton, I'm using the plastic as well, is because I don't want my hands to warm up the butter too much and get it too soft. And then while you're forming the log, Think about how big you want your cookies to be. Um, if you want them to be a couple of inches in diameter or even a li little bit bigger, this is the time to decide because these cookies don't have any leavening in them, so they're not really gonna puff up um, like our regular cookies. But once you get the size you like, then go ahead and wrap it up in the plastic and then do the same thing with the second half of the dough. Now we're gonna take our cookie dough rolls and put them in the refrigerator for about two hours. And when we take them out, they're gonna be nice and hard like this. You can see they don't bend at all. And we get a very sharp knife, not serrated, and we just slice through the cookie about a quarter inch um, in thickness and then lay them out on a parchment lined sheet. Now these don't puff up so you can get more than 12 cookies on a sheet. And we'll bake them at 375 for about 14 minutes and they come out looking nice and light golden brown like this. These apricot shortbread cookies were a hit when I served them with to my friends and family. So if you want the recipe, go to our website. And of course, if you have any questions or ideas, please send me an email. I'll see you next time.